Hello guys, I'm teacher Carla and welcome back to our first online lesson and this is our first class. Let's see what we need to work today. So we're going to need your students book, your notebook. Remember that we have been using your notebook during the class. So we're going to use it uh, in this time. Also guys, I need lots of energy to work on these video lessons, okay? The next thing that we need is to know how to work on our homework, notebook, sorry. So at the beginning of the notebook or at the top, you're going to write a headline, okay? In this case, you are going to write the date and the number of the class. This is very important to have all activities organized. Okay. After this, guys, you can you can answer the the different activities uh, in a simple or an easy uh, an easiest way. For example, if you have an activity when you have uh, when you have to match a picture with a name, you can write. A picture A or picture number one is letter B okay and this is a way that you that you can work on your notebook okay in the case that we when we have a uh, questions you have to write the question and then the answer okay now is to know our units name okay in this time the unit 7 is called get well soon Okay, maybe you are asking, what does it mean that, teacher? So, we're going to use get well soon. We're going to say this to someone who is sick, okay? For example, if you have, if a best friend have flu, has flu, you can say, hey, get well soon, okay? Now, before that we continue with the unit, we're going to make a review, okay? After I show you the pictures, you are going to uh, repeat it at home, okay? Just to remember the name of the parts of the body that we're going to use in this unit, okay? So let's start. Arm. Bone. Leg. Ear, eye, elbow, fingers, hands. Head, neck, nose, stomach, back, tit, toes, tongue, okay? Remember that you can pause the video and rewind the video. When now, you can open your books, your students book on page 68 and 69, okay? In this time, I want you to look at the picture, okay? Look uh, all of the details in the picture, okay? because you are going to have to answer three questions, okay? So please look carefully. These are the questions that you have to answer in this time on your notebook, okay? So the first question is, what body parts do you see, okay? Remember that the three questions are about the uh, picture on page 68 and 69. The next one is, what's the girl's problem? And what's on the cast? Okay. If you don't know what is a cast, uh, you have a picture that is representing what is a cast. Okay. So please 
if you need you have you can pause the video pause the video and answer your questions okay this is the first activity that you have to answer on your notebooks okay now when you have finished to answer the question guys we're going to go back to the the book and you're going to look and answer the chart the green chart okay the green box so let's see the number one what's the matter with her so after you uh, look at the the picture in this in these pages you're going to uh, know what's the matter with her so let's see what are the options to answer this question the first one is a cold a cold is when for example when you go to or outside and it's raining you get a cold okay a broken arm or a headache number two what do you think she feels the options for this as a question is are sorry it hurts a lot it hurts but she she feels fine or the last one better than ever now for number three you have to write a speech bubble for this girl for example what do you think that uh, she's thinking or what do you think that she's saying okay remember that a speech bubble is for example where in the comics you have a speech bubble for what batman or superman is saying okay so here you can write a different answer Now guys, well, let's see what's the difference injury and illness, okay? Now, injury guys is when you are hurt, okay? For example, if you are cutting uh, in the kitchen and you have hurt with the, with the knife, there is an injury, okay? You have two examples for injury and now let's see what is illness. Illness guys, is when you are sick okay for example when you have flu okay when you get flu that is an illness okay for example cancer is an illness okay now guys we're going to learn a new vocabulary for this unit okay so as you can see in the first slide we have have a cold okay remember that you have to repeat after each a uh, picture have a fever have a fever tissues Tissues. Sneeze. Sneeze. Cough. Cough. Eric. Eric. Headache, headache. Stomachache, stomachache. Medicine, medicine. First aid kit, first aid kit. Now, guys, we're going to continue with the book, okay? So let's go back to the book. Now, in order that we know all of the new vocabulary, we're going to understand or we're going to practice this vocabulary in a reading, okay? So let's start reading. Uh, you can follow the reading or you can read by your own, okay? 
Our bodies are amazing. Every day they work hard to keep us healthy, but everyone gets sick sometimes. When you have a cold or you have a fever, it means germs enter your body. You can't see germs, but they can, but they can make you sick. Some germs can live for two hours on your desk. So use tissues when your sneeze or cough and wash your hands with soap. Germs aren't the only things that can make you feel bad. You may get an earache or a headache or a stomachache. It's a good idea to have a first aid kit too. That's a good place to keep medicine. Okay, now, now we know how sometimes people get sick, okay, or have an, on when they have an illness, okay. Now we're going to practice, we're going to practice with this activity, okay. In this time you have to match the correct picture with the correct uh, number, okay. So for example, we have... The number one is headache, number two is cough, number three is stomachache, number four is eric, number five backache, number six fever, and number seven cold, and the last one is sore throat. Okay, so in this time, guys, you have to match the the picture. So letter A is number. I'm gonna help you with the first one. Okay, so letter A is number five. Okay. I now I know that you, this will be your answer if we were in the class. Now, guys, in this time you have to uh, choose the correct answer. Okay, we're going to have eight questions, and according with the picture you have to answer. Okay, you have three possible answers. So let's see the first one. What's the matter? A. I have a stomachache. B, I have a pain in the neck, or letter C, I have a cough. As you can see at the beginning, you already have the answer. And I know that this, this will be the answer that you give me if we were in the, in the classroom, okay? Now you can continue with number two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Remember that you can pause the video whenever you need it. Okay, and this is the example of how you have to answer on your notebook. Exercise one, answer letter C. Okay, when you have finished, you can go to the most exciting part from this video. The homework, as you, as always, it's very easy. This time we have to uh, do a homework, the workbook page six, uh, 56 and 57. Okay. Remember that all of your uh, listenings or tracks are in the uh, online uh, website. Okay. So you can go there and uh, answer if you have this kind of activities. Okay. Well, guys, I hope that enjoyed this uh, our first online lesson. So please do the homework, do all of the activities, and this will be the last part of the video. Okay. So, guys, take care. Be safe at home. Do everything that your parents told tell you guys. And I hope soon, I hope see you soon on the classroom. All of the teachers, we miss you. Okay? See you guys.